Yo, what's up? Remember that Chase Face Show guy? Remember that Sonic What Happened series of videos? Good stuff. <laughs> Good stuff. <clears throat> you ever wonder what happened to those videos lately? Well, if I say the key words, the Sonic fandom is friggin' cancer, would you stop me right there and nod with agreement or burn me at the stake? Maybe a little bit of both? <laughs> okay then. Well, enough is enough and it's time for a change. Come and take your best shot! Now listen up. After saying said keywords, I'm being half of y'all already typing down on the comments below, stop playing this video entirely, or is just watching me right now, but all you're seeing is red and ignoring everything I'm saying right now to properly explain myself. Well, because I can't blame you, really. <laughs> Alright, in case you haven't heard, The Chase Face Show, known for his reviews, his guest cameo appearance on Team 4 Star, and specifically, his What Happened series of videos. He recently just cancelled his Sonic theme What Happened series, all because some fans must have missed that meeting on the concept of freaking patience. Pulling off BS like threatening to subscribe his channel if he doesn't make a new one on time, or bombard him with the same questions that's gonna be a pleasant little subject for his nightmares, like when the next time you're coming out, when the new one's coming out, what do you need, what do you need, or I'll forever be known as that Sonic guy, I guess. But all that mess getting to him, of course he'll let it all out within this video and cancel his Sonic series altogether. For now, of course. I don't know, maybe. And this is why we can all have nice things, kitties. Because one of y'all, okay, most of y'all, had to ruin this for everybody. And I hope you're fucking happy. And no, I'm not gonna specifically blame this solely on the Sonic fan base or whine about, oh, so much I'm gonna miss that one video series I'm obsessing over and treat this like it's the end of the freaking world or even be that guy right now who's gonna pass around insults like autistic, like it's candy, along with the words like cringe, SJW, or weeaboo, and just go on straight down the line of the many other few fellas who all be like, oh, look out now, they use autistic. We got some real fucking edge wars right here, so watch out. Do this world a personal favor and actually read up on autistic instead of dropping out and trying to become the next rageaholic. Okay? Okay. Cool. We'll be in touch. Now with that tangent out of the way. So yeah, this isn't just a fandom thing. That's just a part of it. This is a whole internet thing. After the whole chase face scenario, some of you should learn y'all lessons when to back the fuck up and let talented creators have themselves some space and do their thing in peace. In the end, you'll be known for not learning anything from your past mistakes, like Hollywood making poor decisions on potential franchises, editors doing the comic book writing for the actual writers, or disappointing donators like a Kickstarter on prom night. <sighs> well, that's another trend I thought we'll end up being in. Yippee, am I cool now? Other creators like Mr. Fusion has some fans pestering him on hurrying up on making a new Dragon Ball Dissection video. Or the Super Mario Bros. Z fanbase stressing out Alvin Earthworm to the point of him canceling the original iteration of Super Mario Bros. Z. Though, to be fair, without Alvin canceling said original Super Mario Bros. Z, he won't return and make a more awesome remake after taking a lot of time off of it. And Mr. Fusion has a tough enough skin to ignore petty things like that and doing what he does best. Quality over quantity. Which is one of the reasons for so much time taking place in between their videos. Chase Face may or may not have the backbone to ignore the rabid fan base of anything like others, but like many of us content creators, established or new or otherwise, love to enjoy our craft and not treat it entirely as a job, or being pressured on what is to be expected of the fans for only just one video series. I'm not making crazy amount of rant videos because I prefer to rant about something worth ranting about than join in on some stupid, pointless trend that is being milked by a shallow marketing team. Let it go, people.
we're only human. Unlike people like KP, Nostalgia Critic, or Team Four Star, who have like a team of people working with them to get shit done. Quality varies depending on the person, really, but I'm making a point here, damn it. Even with a team, they have lives like you or me. They had to juggle their internet work and real life work day and night, 24 7, in between all that. The world doesn't have to always revolve around you, people. We don't make things on a strict deadline just solely on you and bend over to kiss your butt if we have done a good job, master. And for the sake of humoring you, because I fucking can. Now, there's a thing called subscriptions. There's also a thing called YouTube channels. And there are about like an ass load of them, if you will. Find something that suits your needs, subscribe to them, and have something to enjoy and watch while patiently waiting for that one channel you've been waiting to make the latest series of videos you've been wanting to see the most. In that way, everybody's happy. Woohoo! You'll see vast amount of varied degrees of good to okay content, and the creators who work their butts off of what they love will enjoy what they're doing in peace without most of you guys breathing down on them. Chase Face doesn't show any disdain to you guys. He just need a break from something you don't apparently want to stop and wait on. And want to take a break to give you guys a fucking wake up call for once in your lives. And I'm just merely responding to it. And need to give it to you straight that most of y'all need to learn this lesson a long time ago. Now, if you want to discuss this with me, you can comment below and we can have a decent discussion on this one. If you're going to be that guy right now and want to talk shit about me instead of doing said discussion like a decent goddamn human being, then you can proceed to get blocked and dunk on because I'm not having time talking to man children. I had to live with one myself and I'm not going to bother with another thousand of yous. Hit my damn music! <laughs>